The truth is that powerful nations such as the United States would not easily read changes about attitudes, about expectations, and relationships with countries that they have dominated for many years. Uh, and so we are not surprised that they went in that condescending manner to discuss with the leaders of Niger Republic. After having had so much space to operate in that country, including running a massive airports or air facilities for deployment of drones and other equipment, they must have thought that they've got the country in their pocket. But really, as your question says, Africa is waking up and Africa will continue to wake up. And we, we can see the signs. And I believe this is the time for colonial countries, those who have colonized Africa and those who think they still have a right to run roughshod over the continent to really sit down and review their policies.